Hey everyone, Dr. Jones here again with another weekly video message and it was a beautiful weekend out. A little cold, but we saw some sun and we're looking at some high temperatures coming up. Hey, um, this week I want to talk to you about the idea of uncertainty. And when I think about uncertainty, I, I think back to a saying that I heard that says, when nothing is certain, anything is possible. And the reason that's powerful to me is because we are in uncertain times. There's a lot going on. Um, we hear a bunch of different viewpoints. Um, you can interpret statistics all kinds of ways, but the fact is we've got to make some upcoming decisions and it's breeding a lot of uncertainty. Now, unfortunately, usually with uncertainty, we tend to jump right to the negative side. When there's a void of information, we tend to make up information and fill that void because see, we're uncomfortable with the idea of not knowing everything. And so, what happens often is that we take that negative aspect and we jump right to judgment. And so our judgment is also negative. Our judgment is automatically that things are bad. And what that does is it doesn't help anybody because often it leads to a negative attitude where we insult or accuse others and make a final judgment on our perceived reality before seeing, so to speak, the whole picture through finding more information. So what I want to do is I want to mention three ways that help deal with this. They're, they're strategies that help us approach it in a more positive fashion. The first thing that we need to do is to clarify the whole situation. We need to clarify what we might not know about it because what that does, why we're looking for more information, we have to keep an open mind. And that's the key part because it's with an open mind that we're able to withhold or suspend our judgment. So before we go pointing fingers or before we make, make statements or anything like that, that might not be on all the facts, we have to kind of withhold our judgment. And when we do that, that puts us in a position to one, either accept the circumstances the way they are and adjust to that new reality, looking for the positive aspects to pull out and help redefine who we are and what we do. And finally, we can work to change the current circumstances. Once we've gotten all our information, once we've decided that this is not for us, for whatever reason, we need to try and work to change those circumstances in positive, productive ways. Because if we do that, people are more open to hearing what we have to say. And as a result, we have a greater, louder voice in how the situation turns out, how it affects us, and how it defines, moving forward, what we are, who we are, and what we do. So those are the three ways. Clarify, accept, or work to change. But no matter what, remember that the way to do things is through positive, productive ways. See, negativity breeds negativity. Positivity breeds an ability to change. And the most important thing about uncertainty or change is to realize that change isn't necessarily bad just because we're uncomfortable with it or we don't agree with it. You see, things happen that we don't agree with, that doesn't make them necessarily wrong. Maybe what that means is it's pushing us to stretch our own limits a little more. Either way, it's important that we keep an open mind and work together, and we do that by being positive, working for all the information, because a closed mind breeds fear and hate. Hey, look, we always have a choice in how we react to things, how we react to circumstances, and how we react to the uncertainty of some situations. Remember to just be positive, search for more information, keep that open mind, and then make a choice as to how we approach it either changing our perceptive perception, pulling the positives out and how they affect us, or working for a positive change. Look, that's it. I hope you have a great week. I hope you found some value in this too. And if you did, please do me a favor, share it to other people. I think it's an important message to keep an open mind, withhold judgment for more information, and be positive. And as always, be purposeful, act with integrity, and continue to build your character. Have a great week.